We help disabled and disadvantaged children to get active and involved in sport. So uh, we provide sports wheelchairs, we provide specially adapted minibuses to get them to and from sporting events. We provide for the very profoundly disabled children, we provide sensory rooms and specially adapted playgrounds. We're looking to get five or six minibuses or even more for um, schools up and down the country and then each rider can choose a charity for their half of the money. Um, our chosen one is Blue Bellwood Hospice which is a wonderful charity in Sheffield. Where I live the inspiration is uh, there is a school uh, probably about two or three miles I pass it every day when I do the cycle and it's there they've got two minibuses there and you see kids jumping in the bus in the morning uh, and getting off and playing, doing some sort of event whether it be cricket whether it be horse riding um, and, and that's the transport they need to get to these events and it, like I said it gives them a great time, it gives them that sporting chance which they wouldn't get otherwise. I was involved in the 2013 Ashes cycle which was exactly two years ago and this one's slightly shorter, uh, two years on and uh, we've got even more riders so we had 70 riders in 2013 and we raised £280,000 for the Lord Taverners and other charities. This year we've got 100 riders and we're hoping to smash that target. And really going round last time, I, I noticed just when we turned up to various stages, there were, we met a lot of children along the way, um, turning up in the minibuses which were supplied by Lord Taverners. Seeing the children's faces, seeing the way they smiled and seeing the way they interacted with us was, was really worthwhile, made the whole occasion worthwhile. People that, you know, like Gothi, who's, who's heading this whole thing and in the public eye, I think it's important to then get involved with charities and give them the exposure that they deserve. And, and uh, with Goffey involved in this and, and other people, uh, Lord Savners is getting the exposure it deserves for, for the great work that it does, and it deserves that exposure. I'm pleased to announce um, that we've raised a quarter of a million pounds already for the uh, bike ride and causes up and down the country. So hopefully with a bit of luck, we might get up to 300,000 by the end of it. The great thing is it's broken down into chunks and everyone waits for each other. So I'll be at the front, or one of the front riders, getting there quick so I can get in and get dry. But then we'll be waiting and cheering everyone in and 24 miles in. Then we all go off together again to the next stop. It's really good fun. You know, I'd encourage anyone who thinks that they can't do it to get involved and have a go if we do it again. You know, I'm a sociable athlete, should we say. Um, but it's really good. You know, you get to do it at your own pace, extremely well organised. And again, you know, the, the word fun. I mean, we're here to raise money for the charity, but do it in a good way. To find out more about our cycle, go to www.investecwin.co.uk forward slash cycle. And if you want to help and donate, go to VELO, V-E-L-O 15, 770 and text T5 or T10. Thank you very much for your support.